Our short visit to dead Moscow, the phantom of the past, is over. Pavel and I helped each other out again and are returning down to the metro as real partners now. You can't survive the wastelands any other way. But now ahead of us lies a populated station, the theater. It's very close to Polis. If Pavel manages to lead me through the red line guard posts, I'll be home in less than an hour. Holy crap. That was wild. Okay, come on in. Sorry about that. Dangerous times, right? We're going up soon. Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Okay, there's a nest in the building by the wrecked plane. I wonder if it's such a bad dream today. Oh, you want a nightmare? Well, it's waiting for you up there. No sense going with just three men. <laughs> Artyomich, so, if it's culture you want, the Bolshoi is up there above us. All the actors who survived are here. Well, people come from all over the metro to see the shows they put on. We've been in the Reich all our lives, and now we're freaks? Uh, this happens all the time. So, that's our plan. The station next to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And Revolution is fitting distance to Polis. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through, and you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Are you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in, then. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here, huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Welcome. Have a good rest. But you do understand that we can't wait All right. forever. Look, I don't make Meet Pablo the theater yes. entrance. Who does that? Is it but so why? Why to us? us they keep way. raising the standards. Last time it was our neighbors. Well, if you enlist, they acknowledge you as a person. Before but anyone thinks the station is just Take it easy. No one's... I always hate seeing, like, kids in games like this. But there's nothing you can do about it. So, it's just like... Maybe while they're talking, you could let us in? No, we can't. Sucks to, uh... Sorry. That's forbidden without the permit. Sucks to think about kids in situations like this, you know? You can join the army and be a citizen again, but your dependents get hanged! The right kind of men. To the red law. Oh, I thought he was talking to him when he said come in. Lol. Um, okay. T -t 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 -t. Bullets to the last surviving theatrical critic. Bullets for mercy on your souls. Here we sit, with drinks and party lights, when all around us radiation. A little Death, community we got going on here. An endless war. Wow. Wow. That is a real man. 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 Why didn't he come is over at once? Sure. 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 <laughs> Katya, he tried Got a little to show for him, that's awesome. It was Juggling. Late. Wow, that's a demon. So scary, just like the a real demon. thing. A demon. Look at the fluffy yeah. wings. It's attacking. So, Nikitish, when do we so can I actually like, buy stuff here? Have you got enough money to last a week? Sell a regular, sell a small week. Two Large. days, then my life is over. Ooh, let's so see. Ammo. Oh, well. Good leadance. At least I had some fun in the end. What? I think I'm okay on ammo for the most part. Make it to stalkers. Well, come back if you need anything. Look, need anything. Look I got money for three days. Some drinks are on me. Oh, okay, so I can buy weapons here, trade in, or sell. Grenades, a portable and serious firepower. Well, feel free cool, to drop all right. Self-defense is everyone's right. Leather, best 
I don't think I have any need to actually like buy food or stuff like that. This is great stuff. They've got a theater. Very nice. Oh hey, what's up? Well, Artyoma, I made all the arrangements. We can go to the revolution. They will let us in through the theater. Anything goes. But hey, I want to be still armed. Just don't come back in ten minutes when you change your mind. It will be I just can't hit a woman. But you are an entirely different subject. Did you hear Oh, hey. sure. Uh, Come in. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. I don't need to watch no show. I'm ready to go. Why can't your boyfriend buy you something better? Artyom? Artyom? Looks like you're a bit woman hungry, huh? Well, yes, yes, it's a hard life without a soft one, I know. Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but, uh, let's drink to the fact we are still alive, huh? It's on me, okay? Here you are, Gover Specials, from the old stock, been infusing it for half a year. Opa, that's great! So, let's drink it to him. Let's go. I feel like I'm getting poisoned right now. Smooth stuff, huh? And this is a good place, but yeah, home is the best, you know. You know, I've traveled all over the metro, and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. That it's awful there, there's no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Wow. So, <clears throat> yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order. And everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true. But no beggars either. Another drink. And now, to equality. Come on, Artyom. No, 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 no. Pay that now. Ooh, хорошо прошла. Ah, uh, where was I? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, look, look at the far stations. They freaking eat each other. Sell their kids as slaves. It's like the Stone Age. Left to his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? Order, order is all that matters. That's, that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Come on, Artyom, come on. Bottoms up. Bottoms up. Uh -oh. So, my friend, that's how it goes. Don't be mad at him. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Private, take this comrade in. Yes, Major, sir. Yes, sir. I knew it, dude. Major. It is private. I freaking knew it. That was so stupid of me. I bought that talk of friendship. The stupid musketeer saying, Just you wait. I will get even. I wonder though, why did Pavel go through the trouble of trapping me? Move it! Hey, stop that, blad! He's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now, you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. We, the people of the Red Line, have worked for you. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. 
At ease, товарищ. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General? Yep. What about Comrade Korn? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Opa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Move it! Let's go. You're a smart guy, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need you. Information. So, my advice to you, my friend? Cooperate. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us, too. Comrade General. Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbett. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky, one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the... Comrade to the negotiation room. Young man, let's dispense with the introductory probing and cut of the chase, hmm? This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. <laughs> but, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lunium must start learning how to improve his, uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Ah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! <laughs> Still nothing, huh? <laughs> you talk, or I'll fry your balls in pig fat. Passwords, code names, operation protocols. What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonia. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no power without blood! There is! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug! God damn it! Butcher. All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him, and shoot the bastards! And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here! No. Oh, I must agree with Leonid. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything.
I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the Dark One? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Corbett! My father! And Morozov! And the revolution and my own future! I'd rather be shot and end up like father, killing his own brother! Listen, if you get out of here, just, well, just live! Here! Get in there! This is the way to freedom. Believe me, I know. <laughs> I spent all my childhood hiding from my father in those vents. Alright, sick. Well, good luck to you! I'm having a hard time balancing the audio with this because sometimes there are moments where the dialogue is really quiet or it's really loud and then times when the guns are loud and when they're quiet so it's kind of hard to keep it balanced so I'll do my best for you. I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you? You're the head of state security and you report to me! Alright, let's keep going. Yes. I have a way of doing it without speaking. Frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground in the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Then we just have to do a sweep. Attention! Comrade General! Soldiers, you are trusted with an important mission. Each group has its task, and you have been told only what you need to know to succeed. But remember that this operation is top secret, and you must not be taken alive by the enemy. I hope that I am understood. Questions? Can we use radios after we capture the assigned targets? Only in case of emergency. Now I am in a real spider-infested catacombs, where the General Secretary Moskvin does not look like the head spider. That title clearly belongs to General Corbut. I sure would like to know what's on his mind. What did Lesnitsky bring him from D6? What's going to destroy the enemies of the revolution? Only questions and no answers. The only thing that is clear, Pavel has information on the Dark One, which makes him my current target. Oh, great. Sick, okay. That's convenient. Oh, I do. Why is C why is C not the default crouch button in all video games? Luckily no one heard me drop the box and no one heard me throw a literal bomb in this room, so we're good. Okay, got this. Ooh, what's this? All right, this one's got a suppressor on it, I think. I assume that's what that is. Just search the rest of this. Yeah, like I said, I'll keep trying to balance the audio. I just don't wanna, I don't wanna make things too loud, but I also want you guys to hear stuff, so. Okay. 
Oh yeah, lots of filters, holy. Okay, let me just make sure I check everything. Don't want to miss any really obvious supplies. Except these ones are locked. I wonder how we open these locked ones. Like, that's locked. I wonder if there's a way to open those. Can I smack them? <laughs> Alright, let's go. Oh, great heavens. Okay. Going after Pavel. Well, if you're a rip, why just blow these guys up? Hands don't mean shit. The important thing is nothing else. The bastard enemies here! Hey guys! Man down! Casualty! Going loud and proud, boys. Could be worse. Oh my gosh, dude. That scared the crap out of me. I forgot that the right click just shoots both shells. It doesn't ADS. You can't ADS with the shotgun. There are moments like that where like the controls will get the best of me where I'll just forget something like that. Wait, did I kill that guy? I think I killed that guy when I accidentally shot. I don't know. Maybe not. Okay, let's go. Give me your goodies. I can't believe we didn't have the entire freaking base on top of us after that. But I figured that was the best way to get rid of all of them at once. I also keep picking up these keys. I don't know how to... Do I use the keys on the locked stuff? Oh, wait. Oh. I keep picking up these keys. What do I use the keys for? Oh my goodness. Okay, weird. There's a note. One thing is completely certain now. The red line is preparing for war. Okay. Yeah, so essentially... We're gonna end up fighting in a giant war between... The, uh... Red army. Oh, hold on, let me see. What is their actual name? Oh, can I not pull out my journal now? Okay, I guess I can't pull out my notes again. Um, but yeah, the Red Army, and then the Nazis, and then the Rangers, which is our group. So we're all going to end up brawling. We're all going to be fighting over that D6 bunker place. Oh my. Good night, son. Yes, sir. Okay, I turned off the power, but it didn't. Not sure what that actually turned off. The quartermaster won't give me anything or send any papers unless you are present. To hell with papers! Tell him you does not replace your weapon tonight. You're both going to the hole. 
And the gunplay and everything in this game is really nice. It just feels super smooth. I like how all the weapons feel and everything. Okay, so we got a guy there. Guy there. I think there's a guy further back, too. Yep, yeah, there's one right there. Oh, two guys there. Guy there. There's a lot of enemies in these areas, dude. It's not easy. I wonder if I could sneak by these guys. If I wait for this guy to come back. I could probably just sneak right through here. So I don't necessarily want to get in a giant fight every time because if I use too much ammo, I'm using all my currency. I do think it's a specific type of ammo. I think it's like the military grade ammo is what's the currency. So I might have just some like garbage ammo I can spare, but okay, he's there. You guys are looking right at me. I just don't know if they'll see me or not. Going for it. All right. I've been ordered to assign you oh, great heavens. That. <laughs> Constructions in a crunch mode. Oh my. Hands, so oh no. Don't see me. Don't see me. I see. Well, since you do, go on and give those two idlers something to do. Yes, sir. Find something to do yourself, too. I don't know if I have anything I can throw to, like, distract people. I have knives. Bombs. 296 currency bullets, I guess is what I'll call them. I'm not sure how to, like, change ammo types. I'm not sure if I can actually, like, make sure I'm not okay. using military-grade ammo. I don't know. Let's find some stuff to do. Quick. Okay, he's looking this way. I need him to turn around. Great. I'll look busy here too. <laughs> Make it look good and we'll keep them off our Okay, I'm going. Alright. Who's that in the box? Fucking turn this off. Oh, that guy was looking this way. Shit. He's got a helmet on, so I What the fuck was that? It was nothing. Nothing that concerns you. Alright. Took care of both of those guys. I don't know if these guys are technically like enemies or not. I'm sure they'd spot me, but I'm not sure if they'd actually fight me. Right. Let them come here if they want anything. But I think we have to assume that everyone is, uh, everyone's an enemy at this point. I hate that little sound cue. I think that means like people are looking at me. I hate that dude. Ugh. Attention all personnel. What the hell did they want? Probably the usual shit about safety precautions. As if we didn't sign in the book. We did, so what good is that? One asshole got run over by a crane last week. No, he lost a knife and a cable broke. That was last month. <laughs> that stupid sound, week. dude, it keeps scaring me. Oh, no, I understand why they're going on about safety like that. That's my line. Who's gonna work if everyone is out of commission? Well, yes. Uh, I wish they'd fix that dumb radio or something. Makes me uneasy, you know? Alright, two guys there, this guy here. Okay, these guys are oblivious, let's go. Oh yeah, 
Yeah, that was sick. That was smooth. I like that. Okay. Let's get all the supplies we can. See, this is locked. How do I open this? I have keys. Alright, let's go. Mark my words. 